Good morning, Central Crossing. Welcome to Thursday and almost the end of the week. I'm Jesse. And I'm Holly. And did you know that we only have 14 more school days until winter break? That sounds fantastic. I'm hoping for some snow. Well, let's go over the weather. What can you tell us, guys? Good morning, Central. Welcome to Thursday. I'm Holly. And I'm Caitlin, and we're here to tell you about the weather. Today will be a high of 42 and a low of 32 and cloudy. Wow, thanks. Also today for lunch we will be having Bosco pizza, barbecue sandwich, or super nachos with three fried beans. That sounds great. Well, that's all we have for you today, Central. Back to you, Anchors. Thanks, guys. Next up we have Gavin and Tyler with information on the Do Something campaign. Hi, Central. I'm Zach. And I'm Tyler. And we are here to encourage you to do something. We are all blessed with so many things, and it's important for us to give back. Now is the perfect time. Here are ways you can do something for someone else. First, please remember to keep bringing in the PB&J. You can drop that in Mrs. Barnes' room. All donations will go to the Mid-Ohio Food Bank. Also, until December 17th, you can bring in gently used or new hats, scarves, and mittens. You can place these on the Christmas tree in the guidance office. And also next week, Mr. Meisner's sixth period is collecting for the Capital Area Humane Society. They will be in the caf cafe during lunch. They are collecting cash. No, no amount is too small. Sealed dog and or cat food. Dog biscuits and treats. Cat treats and can, canned food. Dog toys. And of course, cat toys. And then, as Miss Fuller and the yearbook staff said yesterday, you can donate your hair to children with hair loss. The donation date is December 14th at the Career Academy. You have to have at least an eight inch ponytail, and after the haircut, Clippets will professionally style your hair for free. Here's a I am in the hair salon and I'm about to cut off 12 inches of my hair and donate it to Wigs for Kids. Where? I'm feeling nervous, definitely, but mostly very excited. Here we go! Oh, she's doing it. This is my hair. We just cut the first ponytail. <laughs> oh my god. This is crazy. So I cut this off my head, and now it's going to go into a wig. I hope that my hair can help create a wig that is given to a girl that can give her confidence and make her feel beautiful. Are you excited to get a new hair piece? Yeah. She hasn't sat still all morning. I think I saw it in that room. This is all the hair that was donated from some special people for you. Is that cool? <laughs> wow. Yeah. You want to brush it? If you are interested in donating, see Mrs. Fuller by this Monday. There are lots of ways to give back during this special season. Even a haircut can help someone else. Come on, Central, do something. Back to you, Anchors. Thanks, guys. I think that is really cool that people are willing to donate their due. We all should be doing something, even if we don't have enough hair to donate. Be it that you want to help and contribute to you or do something for the homeless. Whatever you want to do, if you get up in the morning out of a sense of office and decide that I am an opening for the universe, that life can work through and use me as a channel and as an instrument for change.
to realize we have an obligation to do something for other people. And as Gavin Tyler pointed out, there are lots of ways to get involved. Now, let's head to the locker room for sports. Good morning, Central Crossing. I'm Mackenzie. And I'm Wolfgang. And here's what's happening in sports. Let's see what's happening in night. JV freshmen and varsity basketball are at Franklin Heights tonight. JV starts at 4.30. J Freshman JV and varsity basketball are at Franklin Heights. Freshman at 4.30, JV at 6, and varsity at 7.30. Our girls are here at home Thursday against Bishop Reedy. JV at 5, and varsity at 6.30. And here's what's happening later in the week. On Friday, our girls basketball is against Mifflin High School. JV starts at 5.30, and our varsity takes the court at 7. Our swim team is also away at Dublin Sinai on Friday. Girls start at 6, and boys also start at 6. On Saturday, our wrestlers have a tournament. Come out and show your comment pride. Good luck to all these sports this week. To keep you updated on OSU men's basketball. OSU played Virgin the Virginia Cavaliers, who is also 6-0. They play tonight at 9 p.m. on ESPN2. Cleveland Cavaliers lost last night to the Bucks. The score was 101-118. Well, that's it from us. Have a great first day of December. Back to you, anchors. Thanks, guys. And next, we have some fun news. Talent show tickets will go on sale during your lunch period starting today. Tickets are five dollars with all proceeds going towards the 2017 prom. Talent show will be held on Wednesday, December 7th in the auditorium during periods one and two. Once you have a purchased ticket, be sure to put it in a safe place. No refunds for this event. And now, senior announcements. Seniors, if you want a senior picture in the yearbook, you must turn it in to Ms. Fuller before Christmas break. And next, here are some club news. First up, the Outdoor Club is extending the due date to turn in permission slips for the ski trip to 3.30 this Friday. The deadline for money will be sometime later. For now, just focus on getting your permission slips turned in. Meeting Friday is GSA. They get together in Mr. Osborne's room. And now, a few other announcements. As you may know, next week we are on a double block schedule so that students can take the error test. The schedule change really only affects those people with lockout. If you need a copy of the schedule, you can ask any teacher or see the schedule posted in the display case next Big Blue. And then, please take a moment to take the student survey about the advisory program here at CCHS. You can do this anytime between now and December 9th. Go to the school's website and you will see the link. The link for the survey is there below, the photo of the administrative team. The survey should take about five minutes. The advisory committee hopes to take your suggestions and make changes for second semester. Well, that's it for today. Have a great Thursday. See you tomorrow, Central.